The president of the Igbo Social Cultural Group is in Debo in Ikiti State. Ndubisi Kalu has appealed to the federal government to unconditionally release the leader of the independent people of Biafra, Namdikanu, and put a stop to the sit at home order declared in the five states of the southeast. Ndubisi Kalu stated that the federal government should work assiduously towards finding a lasting solution to the crisis. At a gathering of Southeast leaders resident in Ekiti State, the stakeholders called for dialogue and unconditional release of Namdikan. The arrest and the unconditional release, which we requested that they should be perpetrated on Namdikan, which they refused to do, is the main problem that is even drain our economy at the Southeast there. So I want to use the medium to appeal to the present federal government and the leader, the president, to kindly release Martin Namdukano. This present uh, president should call everybody without discriminating any tribe, because there's a lot of discrimination in what I am seeing. From the inception, from the inauguration of the new president, I'm not seeing Igbo people being carried along, and that is not the best. If I want us, I'm, I want to advise him that he should make sure that is the United Nigeria. He can achieve this through invitation of so many tribes. Let them come together. Everybody have one thing or the other to say. So my advice to the Southeast leaders, the governors, the traditional rulers, the PGs of each local government and each state to come together and meet with the new government on board, which is the government of President Tinubu, to come to our aid in the Southeast to see what they can do to ensure that Nam the Kanum is released. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.